A good poem is silence which gets itself known through words. This is Sunil Bhandari and you are listening to Uncut Poetry. And I know these of you. And I know these of you. You gather silence to build your home. You're wise beyond the lies your age tells. You are the unerring compass to what comforts. You need conversations more than you know. That deep inside you, love dines to burst and give. That what's hard inside you is ice which melts and hardens and melts again. That talking to you makes me feel wise about me. That your foolish heart is rinsed in wisdom. You gladden me no end. that sight of you and you are a litany of perchances sinking into my happenstance an accident finding its mean a wild compass masquerading as accident and i know this of you that you are a maybe drenched in certainties and when tomorrow comes to say goodbye you will perforce stay behind as a shadow a sadness as someone found and lost and found again lost and found and never lost again found and lost and found again lost and found and never lost again One of the unending and unerring charms of knowing people is to know them as flawed people whose very kinks make them the weird, lovable, irritating entities who infuriate us but equally make us caring custodians of them. The particularities of their weirdness is not meant for history books. It is often no more than the whimsy of habit, the caprice of reaction or the peculiarity of a stand they take. nothing which takes away from who they are nothing which requires a shovel to check their depths ever so often relationships get predicated on these quirks which are no more or less than the ripples on a pond from a wind which decides to blow on it if we reject the pond we lose the treasures which lie in its depths to know to understand to adopt and adapt to each other's quiddities is to have character and latitude because it entails that we have the ability to look beyond the obvious brass to see the gold inside and to realize that we are equally flawed and in our peculiar ways fun if only someone could look beyond and to meet someone who gives us a glimpse into the gentle and the outrageous the tangy and the plain the obvious and the awesome is to have encountered a whole universe in a person to reject someone like this because the odd thing makes their heart go a flutter or they slurp soup in hideous ways is the biggest injustice we can do to ourselves groan growl but persevere there's too much richness inside which would require years to explore and a lifetime to savor this is sunil bhandari and you are listening to uncut poetry did you know that i've started a newsletter called the uncuts It's a weekly and it is full of grace and music and art and poetry. Get the link in the show notes. And did you like this episode? If you did, you must share it with someone you love. And why not follow Uncut Poetry on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Gaana, Jio Savan, Google Podcasts or anywhere you get your podcasts so you don't miss a single episode. See you next week.